Uh, this is more so I can do on the feet at the moment because I would like to label the feet again. So, this is more so I can do at this stage, I'm afraid. So, join me again soon and I'll be showing you how I do the markings on the sale. Now, this is the part I was I'm actually really looking forward to because I enjoyed doing it on the first round with sale round. So, I'm now going to do his pattern on fabric now. Again, if you're unsure if this will work, it, it'll be fine as long as you don't go putting it through the washing machine or anything like that, but I don't see why you would do that anyway, to be quite honest. Yeah, so that's the outlines done, so I'm going to move that aside and I'm going to do the belly side as well. It'll also look different than this, so back in a minute. Now you can kind of tell it's kind of going in all different directions. I actually made a mistake. I remembered that the belly isn't to be like that, it's to be like this. I'll show you better with the pattern pieces later on, so bear with me. This is the belly outlines done, so I'm going to move back onto the shell. Now what I'm doing here is I'm just wetting the fabric and I'm adding watered down paint to it. You could use an airbrush, but I don't actually have an airbrush, so I just use water. Now, this unfortunately is much I can do with the cell at the moment. It looks great so far, which is good. So I'm going to put that in front of the radiator for the night and I'm going to let it dry. So I'll see you guys when I can start back up on it, when it's dry. 